Operation Warp Speed is also making the necessary preparations to distribute these life-saving treatments at scale. And we will deliver, by the end of this year, a vaccine at scale to treat the American people and our partners abroad. Yes, we're working for a fully approved vaccine, but we'll also use the tools we have, for instance, emergency use authorization um, as, as appropriate. We use all of our regulatory tools to bring vaccine available for the entire American population by January. When a vaccine is ready, the U.S. government will deploy every plane, truck, and soldier required to help distribute it to the American people as quickly as possible. This week, HHS and DOD already announced new contracts to manufacture hundreds of millions of needle and sy needles and syringes here in America for distributing an eventual vaccine. America's staring at another grim week. New cases and deaths will spike again. Without a vaccine, social distancing remains key because only the virus can predict its course. I think things are gonna be permanently changed coming out of this until we get to a vaccine and we can fully vanquish this. We're not gonna see a V-shaped recovery or a quick snapback. Absent the ability to get a highly effective drug in the hands of doctors that can mitigate the risk. The race for the vaccine mm -hmm. is the one that has been outed in the most kind of like nationalistic uh, terms, both in the United States and China as sort of like an arms race. Um, but you're also seeing a huge investment in vaccine research from the nonprofit sector. Uh, frankly, uh, historically, vaccines have not been big money makers for the big drug companies. So uh, it tends to be driven by the nonprofit, nonprofit sector. Will China come up with a vaccine for this before America? Huh. <laughs> That's another question. And will they be honest about it if they do? You can start to see how the story ends, right? They will have a vaccine. Will it be 12 months or 14 months or 18 months? It's still very open-ended uh, up to the point where there's a vaccine that's widely available where this ends. Like, uh, you know, are, where, where are we going to really normally go back to work? What's normal going to be? Will this go to the, the southern hemisphere and then come back or just go to states that didn't shut down and come back? I really don't know. Well, I'll be honest with you. Um, I don't think the vaccine is going to be the ultimate solution, in my personal opinion. Uh, we heard Dr. Fauci talk about an HIV vaccine for years. And guess what? It was antiviral medications that was used ultimately to control that disease. We may see the beginning of a resurgence, and that's the reason why we're pushing so hard in getting our preparedness much better than it was, but importantly, pushing on a vaccine and doing clinical trials for therapeutic interventions so that hopefully, if in fact we do see that resurgence, we will have interventions that we did not have in the beginning of the situation that we're in right now.